Alrighty, we are at New Hampshire MX. This is the track review. There's a public track in Lempster, mm -hmm. New Hampshire? Something like that, it's a couple hours from me, worth the drive, all interstate, which was nice. Costs 40 bucks to ride, um, but also there's like a kid's track uh, somewhere, I don't know where, that costs 30 bucks to ride. Four categories that we rate tracks on are dirt quality, the view, of the track, from the track, whatever, the obstacles and the pit bike ability. All right, so dirt quality. This is the best dirt I have ever ridden in my life, and I'm not even kidding. By far the best dirt I've ever seen. It's not sand, it's not clay. I would say the dirt is just soft. Like there's a sand corner for sure, but it's just soft dirt and there's no rocks. I've seen two rocks the whole day. The dirt is the best I've ever seen, 9.8. Like the best dirt I've ever ridden in my life. It flows so good. Oh my gosh. Also, the track layout, which really should be a category, the track layout is amazing. When I first went out there, I kind of thought like everything came too quickly. Like it was like stop, go, turn, stop, go, turn, like that kind of idea. But once you find the rhythm, the track flows so nice. There's insides, outsides, three lines deep in most corners. Wow, this track is, I, I kind of can't believe it. This track is awesome. And it's, so close to us and we never knew about it. Now, here's the bummer with the view. It's way too windy today to fly the drone. So I'm gonna do my best to get some shots like of the track, of the area, but the view of the track, what's nice is the track's kind of in this like valley, I guess you could say. And you can see it, it's awesome. Also it's fall, which really helps. 7.6, seven, six. that's good. It's a nice looking track. Obstacles, now, the obstacles are kind of funny. They're all very small. There's one step down in the back that I'm not hitting because it literally looks like if you don't do it absolutely perfect, you're gonna die. But other than that, the obstacles are pretty darn near perfect. And I say that because they're small, but they're wicked fun. Like, they're small, but they're the perfect size for how the track flows. There's nothing super scary other than that step down and Man, it's just, it, the, it, the layout of this track is so good. So, obstacles, because they're fun, even though they're small, 8-4. I'm giving obstacles an 8-4, they're really good. All right, last but not least, pit bike ability. I think I need to change the scale. Um, I didn't bring the pit bike. I don't think you can ride a pit bike out here. There's a kid's track that I haven't seen. Here's the thing, I'm gonna give this track the benefit of the doubt, and I know this isn't very fair. But since there's a kid's track, I'm gonna say you can probably ride a pit bike on it, and if the dirt is anything like out here, it would be really good. I'll give it a six, because I don't know, but I feel like it would be good. Now listen, that's probably the highest scoring track so far. At least I hope it is, because this is sweet. This is really good. Anyway, that's the whole deal. Good talk.